And he's circling to his left right now. And he's having some success. He's landed a few straight left hands. And you slowly are starting to see Corey wake up. You know, sometimes a fighter just comes out slow in that first round, and they got the deer in the headlights type of looks where they're only allowing their opponent to, to dictate. And that knockdown, I think, won't hurry up just a little bit. Well, interesting to say, you know, listen, making his U.S. debut, comes out slow start. You mentioned he looked dry to you, yeah, Tim. And he then did. he's hitting the floor in the first round. Yeah, sometimes you got to you gotta take your time. You know, oh, my goodness. Those are some good shots right there. You know, China, China Beck, he is fantastic in transition. What I mean from tra transition, what I mean about that is, is from, from offense to defense and back to offense. When things are coming towards him, he finds a way to land his offense. Wow. Oh. Another big shot there with the left hand. He's hurt. But look at it was as Corey was throwing a shot. He found the opening. Oh, and there's a short right hand and a devastating knockdown. Puts him under the bottom rope. He is laid out, face down. It's over. Big power from Alim Hanala to move to 9 0. Look, first of all, you got to warm up in the dressing room, especially if you haven't been in the ring in over a year. And Aleem Hanala set up his offense, punching in between. Like I said, he has he's great in transition. He's able to find offense in between the eye of the storm. As you can see, Coria throwing punches. He's throwing shots, and he's throwing them back. But... Just the scene precision and the concentration that Aleem Anala has is fantastic. Fantastic boxing ability. I believe that he's, I believe he could be ready. I really, I like what I saw tonight from him. Right, I'm not going to say he's ready. I think he still needs more polish. You know, the, the middleweight division is stacked right now. And I'm not sure which one of those guys will even fight Aleem Hanala. But, you know, he did what I said in the first, what, what he should have did in the first round. He landed a shot that was kind of grazing. And, and Coria got up. That time he turned the left hand over. Coria just started slow. He tried to wake up. He landed a few left hands. But even in that corner, to the young fighters out there, you never exchange in a corner with your back to, to the ropes, mm. with your chin in the air, because that can happen. And then you look at the CompuBox numbers, and you realize when you get an accurate power puncher, you get early evenings like this. In that first round, he threw 16 power punches, landed seven, but then 13 of 23 in that second round when he finished it off, landing 51% of his power punches for the second round knockout. Let's make it official. Here's Mark Chinook. Ladies and gentlemen, here inside the MGM Grand, this bout comes to a conclusion at 2 minutes, 59 seconds of round number two. For your winner by knockout, Janabek. Kazakh style, Ali Mahanala. So the native of Kazakhstan, who lives and trains in Southern California with Buddy McGurdy, he's got all the connections in the world too. With that stable that Egas Klamas has, that has gone on to great success. Let's look once again as to how he finished it. And guys, this left hand, now the short right hand, sets it up but this left hand and watch how Coria doesn't brace himself when he goes down here just off, just off balance just swinging almost like survival mode right there from Coria you know just throwing offense because he wanted to get a lame hana level off of him and set himself up for failure got hit with a big left hand oh my goodness you see his eyes roll back in his head it's exactly what i hit. wanted to point out my watch goodness. on impact the eyes and watch how it's the head that leads first he doesn't brace for the impact oh of goodness. hitting the canvas but Aleem Hanala, look how he turned that shot over right there that, that, that's the kind of shot that that's the type of reaction you're going to get you're going to get when you land a shot like that watch him right here gets in there they have an exchange and he just takes a half step back. He stayed under his feet, and he put everything behind that overhand left. And, and you know, out went Coria. Yeah, Good performance from Aleem Hanala. See, Coria never saw that punch coming. You know, he was bracing himself. He put his hands directly in front of his, his eyes, blurred his vision, and was caught on the side.